for one of the all-time legends of the sport, Mike Smith. Great to have you in Hong Kong, Mike. Thank you. I appreciate it. Happy to be here. You've ridden over 5,000 winners and you've had a superlative season, 15 Group 1s. Um, it's been a hell of a season. It's been a very, very blessed season. It really has. Uh, it be pretty, pretty cool to, to finish it off, you know, winning something like this. These, these competitions, you guys take them very seriously. There's big stakes on offer and, um, you know, you're out there riding with some of the best. I mean, not only the big stakes, but it's bragging rights, isn't it? I mean, to, to beat the best in the world would be, uh, would be a, you know, a great accomplishment. So, yeah, we don't take it lightly. We, we all want to win. What are your impressions of uh, Fappy Valley? I feel like I'm in New York City, I swear to you. I feel like I'm downtown Manhattan. There's Central Park just right right below me. It's pretty, it's pretty impressive. And looking forward to Sunday, you've got a couple of rides. You ride, uh, you ride a little Mike in the Cup. He's the best turf horse in America by far. You know, he was last year. You know, he's been a bit off form this year, but he has come back into form in his recent race as far as, uh, you know, if you throw the Breeders' Cup out, I mean, if he'll run that race that he did in New York uh, the time before the Breeders' Cup, I mean, he, he would be with a, with, with a chance. And King Cruiser looks like a, a likely leader in that race? He's getting good right now at the right time. He was second to uh, Wise Dan, which is our best miler in the United States, uh, also our reigning horse of the year. Uh, so if he was to maybe run that race back, he'd have a chance as well, but it, they're, they're tough races around here. Well, best of luck and uh, enjoy the time. Thank you. I appreciate it.